everyone, and welcome to a very special edition of Ask the Crown. I'm Elizabeth Seyfried, Miss United States 2014, and Miss World Americas 2015. I'm so excited to be introducing the 2015 class of Miss World America, who will be competing this summer in Washington, D.C. in July. Hello, my name is Ashley Flores Johnson, and I'm your Miss Minnesota World. Tell us about where you're from and your family and your community. I come to you from Woodbury, Minnesota. And what I love about Woodbury is it is the perfect combination of city life and country living. Because at night you can see the stars shining oh so brightly. And during the day, it is the perfect place to shop and eat lunch. I have a very unconventional but modern family. I have five siblings, all of us being adopted except my oldest brother. My parents have been married for 31 years, and I have two dogs, Peppy, my Yorkie, and Gracie, my Rottweiler. And yes, she is big. Tell us something about yourself that no one else knows. I'm a huge fisherwoman. I once caught an eight pound northern, which earned me the nickname of Northern Girl from my family. I absolutely love fishing with my family. It is our favorite pastime, and one of my favorite things with doing that is fishing with my uncle and my dad because it's a huge competition and they know that I'm gonna catch the biggest fish. Knowing what you know now, if you could write a letter to yourself when you were young, what would you say? I've actually had the opportunity to write myself a letter already. And in that letter, I just wrote myself on how proud I was of myself. And I was thankful that I held on because at times I did not understand why I was being bullied. It was my number one prayer that I would find that there would be purpose to my pain. And I thank God that there was because not only because now I sit before you not only proud of who I am, but whose I am, and have a message of hope that I want to inspire. It is my hope that when someone looks at me, they say, because of her, I did not give up. Tell us about your Beauty with a Purpose project and how you selected it. My Beauty with a Purpose project is called Raising Hope, Promoting Awareness and Education on Bullying and Suicide Prevention. I chose this project because it wasn't a project for me. At a very young age, I experienced the detrimental effects of bullying. And it wasn't until I was 15 years old that I said no more. I was no longer going to allow myself to be bullied. And I became an anti-bullying advocate. And in 2011, my brother committed suicide because of bullying. And that was the driving force that lit my ignition to save as many lives as possible. Through that, I have been able to work with government officials as well as one of my greatest honors was working with the governor of Minnesota. Knowing that Miss World is a community ambassador, tell us why you should be Miss World America. I want to be Miss World America because of that very first statement that Miss World is an ambassador. For most of my life, I have been an ambassador for bullying and suicide prevention. Winning the title of Miss World America will help me to continue what I'm already doing, except worldwide. Bullying is not just a state issue. It's not even just a national issue, but an international issue. And I would love nothing more than to share my message of hope through and with the Miss World organization. Tell us a fun fact. I have been a traditional Mexican dancer since the age of 10 and my parents actually got me involved because I was adopted and they wanted to expose me to my culture. And I can tell you that there is no better way than to express yourself and to celebrate who you are through dance. Thank you so much to everyone who let us interview them on Ask the Crown and thank you to everyone for watching. I'm so excited to meet all the women in Washington, D.C. in July who will be competing for Miss World America. Thank you.